Well, according to police, there was no holdup of the press conference. They wanted to make sure there was no longer a threat. Still, arguably, this is an example of why top city officials need to live in the city and be closer to their work. The police press conference on the multiple shooting on the campus of Morgan State University had initially been set for 11.35 p.m., but Commissioner Worley didn't step up to microphones until 1.30 in the morning. Within minutes, our BPD fire and police resources were on scene. Commissioner Worley lives in Anne County. He had an estimated 50-minute commute from his home to the scene. The I-team asked police why the press conference was postponed and whether his commute from Anne Arundel County was a factor. Police responded in part writing, Commissioner Worley arrived on the scene within an hour of the incident and drove himself there from his residence. The 11 News I team's Tylee Taylor discovered months ago that Worley did not live in the city as required by the city charter. It states that the commissioner must be a resident and registered voter of Baltimore City at the time of her or his appointment. But it also mentions one short-term exception. If the person before her or his appointment signs a declaration of intent to become a city resident within six months, then they can be appointed commissioner. The next section says if that person does not become a city resident within six months, the official's appointment is automatically terminated. The mayor's office told the I-team back on June 9th that Worley had signed the declaration of intent to move to the city. City officials declined to provide a copy of it. The commissioner addressed the issue Wednesday saying high interest rates had slowed the home hunting process and two houses they were interested in had been sold. I'm smart enough to know that that decision is going to be made for my wife, but we will be living in the city. I love the city. I grew up here. I've been here most of my life. And like I said, the only reason I moved to the Annapolis is my wife said she wasn't moving in with my son and my mother and me. The mayor's office told us back in June that the law department is holding up the release of the commissioner's letter of intent. We asked again today and got no response. Reporting live from the Bishop Robinson Police Headquarters building downtown, David Collins, WBIL-TV 11 News.